very consistent, you know, in Smash 4 up to now. I think he's only gotten better as Ultimate's been coming through with it. Then AC has been kind of has a bunch of different characters he plays as. He's got the Snake. He's got the Falco still, which is actually even better now. Is it, uh, I know he has a Marth that I've seen him. We'll go ahead and watch him play. Um, that's kind of most of what I know for now. I'll be excited to go and see, but AC's tried and true lately, at least in Ultimate, I think is his Snake. I think his Snake is his best character yeah, by man. far. I haven't seen Debo out here in a while, but I think I did see a, a tweet from him recently saying he was like pretty excited to, to start grinding the game again. So we'll see nah, what happens. No, but he's been doing some pretty good placements at some things. Ooh, no, AC! Wow. That was barely 10 seconds. Bro. He destroyed a kid. What percent was he even at, dude? Oh, wow, stock gone. I want to say he's just a boy, but he's not. <laughs> wow. I'm, dang, man. That's forward smash, right? The freaking, that thing, <laughs> the rocket launcher. I didn't expect that. That was what an explosive start. No pun intended. Actually, you know, getting started off uh, with that. You, you, meant, you, meant, you intended that pun 100%. Own it. Yeah, you're right. Everybody tries to go ahead and do that kind of stuff. They say that all the time. Why do the people, I, no, no pun intended, and then know, it was man. actually intended. I don't know, man. Nonetheless, Debo. I honestly, I thought about it as I was saying it. <laughs> He's gonna have a really, really tall mountain to climb here. AC once again going for that forward smash. Uh huh. I mean, if it works, why not try Dude, it? Again? Just watch how he's like walking so menacingly. Oh, wow. <laughs> like how you say that, like it's like menacingly. He's just walking menacingly. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Debo already at 103% on his second stock. And AC is still already, you know, yeah. on first stock at 70%. And he's snake. He's going to be heavy. Devil's got a lot of groundwork to go ahead and cover if he's going to go ahead and bring himself back in this game. Nice. I really like the B-reverse grenade there to switch up his landing. And he is able to catch Debo slipping in the air. Gets that stock with the upper. Absolutely with that. He's actually looking pretty rough. But Debo because he gets the forward throw. He's got a little bit of an opportunity. He gets. Oh, wow. That oh, was weird. And he takes it, though. Tech. Oh, man. It ended up putting Debo in a really bad situation, allowing AC to edge guard with a down tilt. Yeah, the capitalization from, from AC is actually pretty good. Grenade. Ooh, and okay. he mixed up the DIY myth throwing him backwards. I don't think he actually died that, or at least wasn't prepared to. Yeah, he might have just not been prepared to. No, because he was on the other side of the yep. stage. I think that he was probably DIing in towards the stage. Still Debo in a rough situation. Gets it down there though. He's starting to go ahead and put in some percent. Back throw, back air. He's at 69. Gets the grab. Hey, lots of damage. Oh, he missed the, the read. Follow up. Reading the roll, up tilt, securing that first game. I have to give it to Devil though. After that first stock, which he absolutely got murdered on, uh, he kept his pace pretty well. And if so, if it hadn't been for that first stock, we may have seen a closer game. It might have. There's the yeah. mental adaptation that he has to right now. What he's doing right now, he's taking the time. Both players taking some notes about each other. It was just a very interesting first time. I'm pretty sure AC didn't mean to go ahead and kill him with forward smash. He probably was just you know, like, like I think if this to. works, no. I'm going to love it. I think he meant to, dude. He went for it. But, yeah, I think uh, Debo, the, th the thing that he's got to worry about is just, you know, I fully believe in his capability as a player to adapt but he's got to do it fast because AC is making these reads and he's making these reads that are converting into stocks. I mean, he's doing his tag just as fundamentals, my guy. Uh, is that what his tag says? Yeah, I fundamental. Even, I didn't even notice. Yeah, no. Fundamentals, AC. bro. <laughs> oh, that's all you got to have. You got the fundamentals. You can go ahead and do anything. Ooh, wow. Good graves, actually. Tebo actually pretty, is pretty good early percentage. But he's also playing a lot more patient. AC with the swerk. So it seems like Devil has already started off some of the adaptation. He has the early percentage. He's playing a lot more patient. Yeah. But at the same time, still in his face. Oh, my gosh. Ooh, good. He forced him to air dodge there. Yeah. Wasn't able to follow up off of it, though. Unfortunately, a little bit too much end lag from that uh, PK flash. But it's like you said, Debo um, is playing this a lot more patiently as he should. Manages to recover some damage there. I feel like he's starting to also move a lot more faster too. His button inputs are being a lot more smoother. They're a lot cleaner. His, his decision making is they're, a lot more different than it was better, in the first game. Better spaced too. A hundred percent. He's been you know moving out with the ideas to try to get help back from the keto and the grenades, making that option for Macy not as uh, you know as amazing as one would think about it in any of the matchup. Wow. But that edge guard. 
the down smash, securing the stock. That's such an awkward like kill, honestly. Like I didn't, you don't really expect it to hit on the ledge like that, but show sure enough, it does. Gets the PK fire with that though. Devil has to go ahead and find his way back in this game. If, if he's gonna go ahead and steal it, he needs to secure stock. Tries to put the PK Thunder, not there happening. Gets the up air, oh, no still way. no death. AC playing that amazing DI. Godlike DI. Ooh, but you can't DI that. No All way. All you can do after DI is eat die. <laughs> Down smash uh, from Debo this time, actually. Putting them at an even stock game. But still moving just a little bit faster. AC continues to go ahead and put the pressure on. Good tech out from Debo. I didn't think he had to tech that. Goes in and gets back to stage, but it doesn't matter. AC has been watching all of his, his edge options. Let's him back to the stage. Debo now has a chance to go ahead and... Never mind, no chances there. Up tilt, he's gone. Yeah, Debo on his last life here, potentially, of the winner's bracket. AC up one game. This might be the end of the line for his winner's run. Yeah, I know, it's looking pretty rough. He's got the backer. He tries to go for the RPG and heals off the explosion. I didn't think he could heal off the explosion for that sport smash. At least if nothing else, we're still seeing some interesting check. Dude, it's just really, really, it's been really difficult um, for Debo. He's been taking a... Ooh, and the down smash! Wow. Is that, that's it! AC gonna go ahead and take it up 2-0. Yeah, unfortunately, uh, not the greatest situation to roll away there. Oh, no, um, but he called him out for it. That down smash covered off a lot yeah, of Yeah, I mean, it, co it covered it covered the roll away, and it would have covered the roll in behind him as well. I, I don't know if he could have maybe gone for a get-up attack to just beat that out, but uh, maybe I'm wrong. But uh, that's going to be the end of the road for us. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed Wave 1 of Pools. And, uh, yeah, you'll have two very fresh new commentators for Wave 2 of Pools. It's been an honor getting able to commentate with you, man. Of course, man. It's been a lot of fun. I've, it's been an incredible decision. I've been trying to go ahead and apply to go ahead and commentate here for the last three weeks. I'm so happy to get the opportunity you got it, to man. go ahead and do so. You got hang it. Hang out with you guys. Hang out with you and the rest of the 2GG crew. But that's going to be it for us now. Uh, see you guys later. We'll go ahead and get the break.
Hello everyone, welcome. We are here at MSM 236 for Wave 2. I'm here Wolf Scratch, joined by my friend. I'm Yo Schiller, it's a pleasure to be commentating with you today. Yep, and uh, well, Offline's finally here. Thank yeah. goodness. Yeah, uh, I know. I, you know, people always say like, playing online is a lot different than playing offline. Oh, I'm like, yeah. no, nah, you're making stuff up. And then I went and played on one of these TVs and I was like, whoa, I'm actually misinputting because I'm used to the mm -hmm, delay yeah. from online. So. I think, yeah, I think one of the worst things is like, when I see people like they're trying to tech offline, I know. They're, they're messing it up because they're so used to like the Wi-Fi.